Well, we're starting just a tad later than we usually do this morning, starting at 7.45, hoping to get out of people's way as they take their kids to school. We've already been blocking driveways, had some complaints, so we don't want to be doing that for much longer. We have got the greatest abundance of food. There's our walk-up line over there. Our produce line, there's strawberry in there, there's lettuce in there. There's eggs here, there's chicken there. Spinach, yay, spinach there. That's what's in the pack. Thank you to the packing team who was here yesterday. Everything packed out beautifully. Have a good week, you guys. Um, more spinach. There's Beth, one of our hardest workers. There she is, way to go girl. There's Marty, what a team those two are. Frozen goods on this side, so we have four cars going at a time. So hopefully we can work our way through that way. There's the food that's backed up. We're just getting started. So what they do is they roll the food in. As it comes through, have a good week, man. Hi, Bart. Okay, como se dice closer, move closer. Uh, Muevete. 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 Buevete. Buevete. Bu Gracias. Buevete. Buevete. That's not what you time. Buevete, huh? <laughs> Have a good week. Buevete. Is that right, Mary? No, por favor. Huh? Buevete, por favor? Yes. Oh, boy, would they bar bar Why, is that the rude way to say it? Yeah, muévete, yeah, that's rude. What's the other way? Circa date something? No, circulando, circulando. Ah, no, every, no. I've learned three different ways now. I'll never learn Spanish. It's all too hard. Oh, sí, sí. Bueno, bueno. Muévete, huh? <laughs> muévete. 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 Hmm? Muévete. 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 Move it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm learning so many different ways to say it, man. <laughs> Have a good day. I hope everything helps. You would think after all the years, I should speak Spanish fluently now, huh? Mi español más más bueno, but muy malo. No, no, no. Todo muy bien. No, gracias. Muchas oraciones para mí, gracias. Hola, Pedro. ¿Cómo estás? Morning. morning have a good day take care hey man what are you reading this week still in there huh i'll tell you what i'm doing my studying on the heavy theology these days on artificial intelligence it works great man you can research all these guys <laughs> morning so the line is all the way down the street this morning so we needed to get things going thank you so much to everyone who supports our work what a generous gift of spinach we come on Arlene get on up there girl Muevete. <laughs> Muevete, por favor. That's a matter of one of these. Morning. Hey, how are you today? Como estas? Ah, perfecto. Gracias por su trabajo. I only sound like I speak Spanish. That's the important thing to understand. Oh, look at that. There's Officer Angulo. Morning. So we knew we were backing up traffic. There's the bus. You can see it way in the distance, about a quarter mile down there. Officer Angulo, how are you doing? So that means there were lots of people complaining. Officer Angulo has been awesome to us. 
been a real help. Escucho. <laughs> I always make that means listen. I always tell people, yeah, you want to listen to him. He's the guy in charge of our entire neighborhood, and he comes out here on his motorcycle and checks us out. He's the guy who turned around our line. We don't block the corner anymore, but move up this way, okay? So, uh, yeah. Gracias. Um, Anyway, as I was going to say, thank you so much to everyone who supports our work, including Riverside PD out there directing traffic today. Um, what a blessing. Today we have got literally over a ton of spinach giving away. Everyone gets a full case of spinach. I woke up at like 2 o'clock in the morning. I was researching, can you free spinach right in these bags, just in case we couldn't give it all away. Just... For your knowledge, you can take these bags, when they're those triple wash organic spinach bags, it doesn't even have to be organic, and throw the whole thing right in the freezer. So if we end up with some left over, we can freeze it. So everything is going swimmingly right now. Pastor Ken, thank you so much for taking a couple days. We miss you here, but we're glad you've got a couple of days to been with Trisha. There's Mary, one of our hardest workers. She's here at 530. She hates being on camera. The police are out there, Mary. So we got to keep them close together. Anytime you'd like to support our work, um, Siempre para los Niños. We're looking to raise $100,000 right now. We could use a check. Um, Jacks for Jesus. We're putting together, we're hoping to save some of the spinach for the streets. And, of course, our ministry with the food here. Central Community is so gracious in keeping everything going. You can always write a check here. You can just go there and you can go to 14jc.com. And you can do the drop down. And in the memo portion, you can just put, um, you want this to go for the food distribution. And it helps pay for that. I just, we spend tens of thousands of dollars on this. I'd like to say I'm making that up but it's absolutely true. Here's the walk-up line. These are people who walk up to get their food, come to the gates. When we put that gate there, we had no idea this is the way it was gonna be utilized. So, God is good. There's Sal, one of our hardest workers, Anna, Cece, hard workers, all, everyone volunteering like crazy. Police are out there. Thank you so much. <laughs>